Someone wants breakfast. Someone wants breakfast. How to want breakfast? Do do. So let me work out real fast, and then we're gonna go hop back into Sequoia. Sequoia. We're still trying to get in the park here. And the line has built up behind us. Apparently, we need tire chains if we want to drive up and see the big Sequoias. There are places back in town that rent them so we can turn around and go get them or just call it quits. <laughs> I don't want to go get tire chains. All right, but we're following the rules and we're not going to get stuck in the park, so it's all good. But we just waited in that line for like 20 minutes, so that was kind of a waste of time. Let's find the tire chain rental. We definitely saw it on the way in. Let's see. All right, I got to try these tire chains on now. And if they fit, then we're good to go. Hi, Huts. I know you've been waiting in here. I gotta try the tire chains on. <laughs> Pretty proud of myself here. I successfully put them on. They look good. Um, yeah, they fit. I did have this one tighter, but I gotta take them back off now because you don't wanna drive with them if you're not on snow. That legit took so long, but we got the tire chains now. And we're at the car. Huts, I'm sorry, that took like five years, buddy. Good thing it's cool out here. I know. All right, the tire chains are in the back. Don't go more than 20 miles an hour when they're on. And don't put them on until there's ice. Now let's go to the freaking park. Holy heck, it's like 11 o'clock now. All I can say is these trees better be freaking worth it, bro. It costs like $50 to rent these chains for a day. We have them for a whole day, so we could come back tomorrow too, but only if we come early. Holy hot diggity dog. That took 5,000 years. This better be worth it. These trees better be awesome. Okay, that took five years, but we, we made it. And the line is shorter now because everybody and their brother's already in here. We're back. We got chains. Great. No map for you? Nope. I'm good. All right, Lane. Thank you. Take care. <laughs> forest is 17 miles up the road here. We're gonna eat Cheez-Its and drive. I was so excited this morning. I'm not even excited anymore. It took so long to get tire chains. This is how far we made it yesterday. This is Hospital Rock picnic area. And here is where the road was closed yesterday. Oh shoot, here we go. Look up there, the mountains are in the clouds. I love this guy so much. Look at this view. That's pretty stinking epic. What do you think? You're sleepy boy. You're snoozing in the car. You're missing out on these views, buddy. We're about to join this uh, party over here of putting chains on. Scooch it and mooch it and All right. All right, 
that's you sit and look pretty while I get the chains put on the car. Okay? Okay. He's a good boy. All right. The chains are on. I think they're on correctly. What do you think? You think we did good? I think we did. Yeah, and you just made friends with the girls up at that car. You're just a handsome boy. Moment of truth, we're gonna start driving and we'll see how this goes. Can't go more than 20 miles an hour with these chains on. Bye. 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 <laughs> oh, fucking oh. They're sounding pretty loud. I hope this is correct. I've never driven with chains before. It's loud. We gotta go slow. Straight out, bro. Oh my gosh, they're huge. I'm in love. Look at these giants. Holy smokes, boy. We're in the giant forest, buddy. got out here. This is Wolverton apparently, this little area. It's a play snow area. <laughs> and Hutz is going to take advantage of it. <laughs> We're parked right over here. We got to stop and get some pictures with the big trees, but that's on the General's Highway. Yeah, you're a good boy, aren't you? <laughs> you're a snow puppy. You snow puppy. Yes, you are. Go on, snow puppy. <laughs> he just sat down in the snow to pick the snow off himself. That doesn't make much sense, bud. It doesn't make too much sense. Come here. Let me help you. Come here. Good boy. Yeah, shake off. Can you shake off before we get in the car? Mm-hmm. You got snowballs stuck on your legs? Yeah, a little bit. And then up here? Oh, we gotta pick it all off. Yeah. Look at that. That like just opens next to this pole. I will be right back, buddy. I'll be right back. I at least need to get a picture. We're in the giant forest. Pretty sure that right there in front of us. One of these is the biggest tree. There it is across the open space. Yes, that's the General Sherman tree. Let's go get a picture. We're gonna go so fast. Whoo, it's cold. There's no way to like capture really how big these trees actually are. They're gigantic. Okay, we're so close to the General Sherman tree. Let's just get there. Let's get there. Oh my, Atlanta. These are the biggest trees. That back there, that's the biggest tree in the, in the US. General Sherman. General Sherman. 
super awesome girl took some pictures for me. <laughs> the snow is more fun, huh? You're like, finally we're walking. Yeah, we're finally walking. <laughs> Hudson loves the snow. Hold on. Scooch over. Over. Hello. Hello. <laughs> that was so much fun. Okay, hey, hey, hey. Walk across the bridge. Your little sketch ball. Look at these trees. Whew. Can't even really tell you're in a park. Oh, look at these. Look at these trees. That's all I gotta get. That's all I gotta say. The trees, the trees, the trees. The trees. That's an Oliver. Here so much water, so much melted snow. Back to the car. Now we gotta clean your paws off. Uh huh. Let's see. Look at that. Freaking puddle of water. These socks are soaked. About to change into Crocs. Yep. Uh, I'm leaving. All right, we're officially on our way out of here. It was nice to see the trees, but now we're getting out of here. We're leaving the giant forest. This is it. That's it for our trees in Sequoia here. You're so tired. You had fun in the snow. Hi. I'm gonna take the chains off. I'm gonna be honest, taking the chains off was way harder than putting them on. Putting them on was like cake. Uh, but I don't think we need them anymore, so I took them off. Yep, look at all these people taking their chains off. We stopped and took ours off at the perfect time. It was a pain in the butt to get them off. Getting them on, way easier. Look at this view we got coming down. That's pretty sick. Live in the park. All right, chains are returned. Time to go find camp. It's been an expensive ass day. After a hard day, you just need a peanut butter Kong or a scoop of peanut butter. This is dessert right here. Look at this. Ooh, that is delicious. Oh, I have so much pasta sauce on my face. Oh well. So I'm just playing with Hudson in this like grassy area around here um, and picking up junk that I see and I'm putting it over here. What in the heck? This has got to be the weirdest thing. This is like for holding like a thread for like stitching or suturing. Interesting. That was in the grass right here. This is our collection of garbage so far. Just going for our nighttime walk. It's like five o'clock right now. I'm very happy that I already worked out. Having to work out right now would be such a bummer. But we're done. We chick -a -chick -a -chick -a -chick -a -chick Check that off this morning. 
Look at that sight. It is so beautiful. It almost looks fake. This is right behind our campsite or campground. Our car, you can see way over there. This is awesome. Look at this. We got like trees in a in a swamp over here. In that nice green hills. Look at these ducks over here. He freaking loves chasing birds. Loves it. No. As long as he stays out of the water, I'm fine. We're good as long as you're not in the water. Yeah, you got some burrs I need to get off? Probably. Probably. Hold on. Hudson's version of happiness is going hiking all day, adventuring, and then coming back to camp where he gets to chew on a nice stick. That is a good stick you found. That is a good stick you found, bud. That's nice. We're just getting ready for bed and the sky decides to turn all gorgeous over here. This guy's pretty gorgeous too. I gave him just a few little treats in there to keep him busy for a little bit before we climb in. Even though I already brushed it, his teeth. Sorry, he needed a little bit of more treats. That's what he said. You can't argue with the man. He's, he's fading away. He's starving. That's what he tells me every day. I am starving. He doesn't get fed twice a day and get snacks every time I eat and get to play with toys like that every day. He's, he's not spoiled at all. All right, time for me to climb in. Hello, darling boy. Let me take your collar off. Oh, you got one right on your neck. One of those cackle burrs. We'll get that off you. Okay. You got any more on you? Let's go. Night, guys.